Good morning, everybody. This is Kathy from Family Farm Livestock, and today you can tell we have the loading racks on the truck. We're selling my boar. His name's Toby, he's a Berkshire, and we're going to sell him today because we're keeping a gilt that's his daughter. So we need a different boar. This is Toby, our Berkshire boar. And we're going to sell him today. He's on the truck with the racks. And so are the goats, as you can tell. We just ran him up this ramp here. There's a view of the, that's just the sorting chute for sheep. And then here's the ramp that we ran him up. We use it for lambs, pigs, whatever. Obviously too small for cattle. I think it's the 19th today. I bought him October 25th, so I've had him for almost a year. He's the dad of the market hogs we have now, and then our sow should be having another litter sired by him within a month. The, and he does a beautiful job. He's a great boar. Um, the reason we're selling him is because from the first litter, there's a gilt that we, my husband and I both really, really like. And if we, since we're keeping her, it's just not good policy to keep her dad as the boar you use. So we'll get another boar. She's six months old right now. So we've got about two butts. Sliggy so scoping things out. You can see the size of him a little bit better. He's a Berkshire. His pigs grow fast. They're great. It's just that we're keeping his daughter. There's a little bit better view of the loading ramp leading into the sheep working chute. Obviously built for sheep, but anything that'll fit, it funnels them down towards the working chute so you don't have to set up gates or whatever. And since it's solid sided, they keep walking rather than thinking about breaking out, especially on pigs.
these are some of the market hawks coming over to see what's shaking. tell they're hollowing out this is all bedding from when the sheep were in here some sheep were in here this winter so they're working on digging it out and despite the fact that it's dark it's all dry you could sit in here anywhere except right there by the water because they always spilled and they like to lay it in a little way They got room to move around. Comfy place to lay down. And let's go look at the gelt we're keeping. It's the one closest to the water barrel. all the spots. And like I said, she's about six months old. So still a f um, two months until we need a bore. But these are the almost ready to sell market hogs that are Toby's babies. And this is Whitney. She's the mom of the market hogs. And Toby was in here. So that's kind of the downside of selling Toby is that Whitney's by herself. But the plus side for Whitney is that she'll get more of the feed. I've been having to overfeed Toby because he sucks down corn whether he needs it or not. And I was trying to put a little more weight on Whitney. She's looking better now. And Whitney's about a year and a half old. I got her and 12 other pigs in a group of just crossbred feeder pigs that I bought. And then decided to keep her back. She does a good job. She's a nice mom. And she has a good attitude. It's about, he's going to Kidron today. It's about mm, a 45 minute drive. <laughs> 